We have our first delivery of the year and I am so excited to see them. It's a brand new product that has been highly anticipated. I made a big bet and of all things it was on passport covers and luggage tags because hear me out so many people have commented that they want travel accessories with my prints so I thought let's do it let's try it on second thought most people don't need more than one of these and keep them for years and years so maybe no one will want them I don't know it's fine I want to show you this new product I've been getting so many requests here they are and these two. It's my first new product release of 2024 and I was hoping for a strong start. I'm not 100% confident in these travel accessories, but I think they're really cute and they work really well. I was super careful about this product design and I hope they do good. I literally never know what to expect. I thought for sure that this was gonna flop. I've had bad product releases in the past and I was convinced this was gonna be another one. And I mean, we still have a billion of these, but people were way more interested in luggage tags and passport covers than I was expecting. I know I should've just had faith that people would like these, but it's hard when I've seen so many flops in the past. So I'm just grateful this wasn't another one. So I'm in a little bit early to get started on the fulfillment of all of the passport cover and luggage tag orders. We released them on Friday, so that is all up on our website now. The couple of like TikToks that I post about it did pretty well. So we ended up, I think, selling like a couple hundred of each which I wasn't expecting at all. Like I really, when I saw how many boxes were delivered, I was like so nervous. I was like, wait a second, like is this the item that I need to have this many boxes of? Like, anyway, I've had bad releases before that have flopped and I was like, sure, <laughs> this is gonna be another one. I was sure that it was gonna go badly. Um, we still have, I think like 85% of everything that got delivered, but like we made a dent, like that's really good news. I'm like, I'm excited, I'm excited. Like the bar was low and we cleared that. So anyway, I'm gonna start packing the orders. <laughs> I got my initial stack. I separated them all by design. A lot of people, like I think the majority, ordered one of each. So one luggage tag and one passport cover, which is awesome. Um, and then, so I separated out the people who just ordered one, like a passport cover or just a luggage tag. And then I separated them all by design so I could just grab a chunk and then pack them all. Best seller for, um, the passport covers, primrose, love that. Which like, okay, this is just like a very random side note, but um, at the trade show, people honestly couldn't tell these two patterns apart. Summer Meadows, she is circa 2020, 2021. Um, and primrose petals, circa last year. Um, and so like, they're similar, pink, you know, but, yeah, people truly couldn't tell them apart. Both sell so well independently. Like, like I thought like, okay, the people who are interested in this vibe, they'll split between these two. No, they both are independently bestsellers. So good news for Jordan, because Summer Meadows is her favorite. She's gonna be around for a while, um, but yeah. And Primrose has been very popular. So I guess I think it's just that like EBD customers like pink. Um, and these are the two most pink and I agree with them, they're adorable. So, love it. <laughs> also, another side note, porcelain is a big seller in passport covers and luggage tags so far. And I think that really makes sense because it is giving like a Amalfi Coast vibes, which, you know, 
you gotta travel to get there if you live in the US. So I'm excited for that because she is a fine seller, but she was like definitely like second tier as far as popularity with the planners. But passport covers, she's going crazy. Okay, I think those are all the ones we need. We can grab some of those. Now, luggage tags right over here. Wowie, wowie, wowie. Okay, so I'm starting with the primrose like sets where people got the passport cover and the luggage tag together. Let's open this up. And I got five of these. These are all orders from TikTok shop. I haven't even dug into our website yet, but I just wanted to get started on a few, like maybe these are just from Saturday morning, I think. There you go. Something I sort of think about, but always comes into play when I'm releasing a new product is the type of box that it's going to ship out of our warehouse in, or in some cases, mailers. Boxes are pretty expensive, honestly. Like they're usually over a dollar per box. When you think about just like one item inside of that box, it can really rack up the cost. But I do try and get really sustainable recycled and recyclable boxes and poly mailers whenever possible. So that does increase the cost, which is totally worth it to me. But if I can use a recycled mailer, I try and do that because it does make the shipping process a lot less costly and we can fit more of our mail in the back of the mail truck when it comes because believe it or not, sometimes we have to have the mail truck make two trips because we have so many boxes. So that was something that came into play with the passport covers and luggage tags was just trying to figure out which mailers we could put them in and I tried to put them in paper um, cardboard mailers because those are just the most efficient and sustainable ones that we have. I got started on a bunch of orders and now I'm gonna just try and print some more, organize them by pattern and then once everyone gets into the office in like an hour, then um, we can all just kind of knock them out really quick.